Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII! Last time we managed to take on the threat that is the diamond weapon and got Cloud, his ultimate weapon. It's really confusing that they use the same word for the two separate things there, but whatever. We, got, we took, took him down and caused this massive crater here. Now the reason that we took him down at the time that we did is because we want to do a thing in the gold sorter. And that wouldn't let me do that until we'd actually got Cloud's ultimate weapon, but yes! Now is the time. Let's go inside and have a look here. How do we want to set up Cloud for this? I'm not entirely certain. If we come inside here, I mean, Time All, Mega All, th these are all pretty good. In fact, I don't see any reason why we couldn't just go with this. I mean, maybe we'll want to take the W Magic and the Contain off of there. Yeah, okay, I'm going to go to the Gold Saucer and I'll meet you at the Battle Arena with his complete setup. I always feel like the battle arena kind of needs its own music. Yeah, how this has got the same as the rest of the gold saucer, but the, the Choco Chocobo Square has got its own music. Why doesn't why doesn't that get some music? Hey, I've been thinking about it for a while now, but you must be pretty strong. Well, lady, I don't want to brag, but probably strong enough to take on the top one or two of fighters. Well, I'm going to go save the world, you know. Maybe you'll be good enough for the big match. I mean, like, hopefully. How about it? There's a private battle for only the strongest. Want to try? You yeah, let's do it. You can fight up to eight battles, but the more battles you fight, the greater the handicap. Yeah, we all know that. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. So, I've got the ultimate weapon on the go. I've got the standard Hades um, added effect and stuff like this. I've also got counter attack. Um, I, 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 will, I will show you in a second. Right, the thing we need to do, big guard, is a must. Did I just white win myself? Did I double, double press that? I also have a ridiculous number of counter attacks set up. Like, absolutely ridiculous. Okay, I think for this one we're gonna get the level. Yeah, that, that seems pretty good for me. See, this guy, also pretty easy to beat up. We'll just go... Oh, I should I should have done the big guard. I should have done the big... I pressed the button, so my brain was like, yeah, you've done that. But here comes a slash. Oh, pow! On nines across the board. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do about it? Oh, man. What am I gonna do? Maybe we'll uh, drop some MP. Okay, there we go. That that should be fine. It's a creepy touch. Um, uh, enemy skill. Big guard. This is what we're trying to do. This is what we're trying to do. Okay, this this should be good now. I should be a little bit more set to receive any punishment that is being handed out. Though, honestly, doesn't look like that's a great camera angle. Uh, doesn't look like much is going on with the beating so far. 500 points of damage. You have got to be kidding. Here, try try a few of my counter attacks. Why don't you? And, of course, my actual slash all. So, one of the things I countered with is the double cut. I think that's pr a pretty good idea there. Pretty good idea. Uh, you can see we've got W Magic Ultimate. I didn't actually mean to leave the W magic on there, but let's go with it anyway. Why not? Uh, I also have counter, magic counter with, with ultimate. I think, I think I, I should double check that. I just kind of like threw a, threw a bunch of materia around and was kind of hoping. Do I not get a second one or do we? Okay, okay, that, that's fine, that's fine. It's just kind of breaking it up with the with the other guy there. That, that's, that's cool. The counter-attack from him, I suppose, is okay. I'm, I I can't be the only one to counter-attack at any point, can we? Okay, uh, ooh. Uh, I'll take the down level, actually. I don't want to break my... Uh... Oh. <laughs> well, there we go. The one thing I didn't want to break, totally broken. Uh, suppose we're going to... I don't know. What are we going to do here? Uh, first thing I want to do is a turbo ether. I noticed things were getting a little bit desperate there. Uh, has not my counter attack struck? No, not yet. Okay, that's okay, I suppose. Man, literally all my per uh, my command material. A little bit of a shame. A little bit of a shame. Okay, let's slash all as well. He is asleep at the moment, though. That's pretty good. I wonder how much damage we do have to tilt, uh, hand out for this to be super effective. Is that not a death? I was kind of expecting a death right there, if I'm to be honest with you. He's still asleep, though, so no big problem. Bam! There we go. Counter-attacks are the winner. Okay, yes, please. Uh, I would like that. Ooh, let's try again. Uh, time. It wasn't quite what I was after, but it will do. Okay, time to do a heal, I think. I don't know what you guys think. Three elixirs. Need to get better than that. Okay. Uh, turbo Eth. Uh, sorry, X-Potion. Here we go. Yep, don't at all get mixed up between those two. Uh, then we're going to W Summon. Oh, wasn't it? No, of, of course not. The yellow stuff is broken. It doesn't work like that. Oh, well, that, that's fine. That's fine. Hopefully, Ultima should be the one to finish him off here. But no, no, actually doing better just hitting him. Okay, fair enough. We'll, we'll go with that. Yeah, actually by quite a few points. All right, we, we will only hit things from now on. Um, yeah, zero MP. Why not? Why not? 
Beowulf, how are you doing? Let me do a turbo ether quick. That should be fine. Bash. Another one? No, no. Here comes the turbo. Of course, the yellow command interior is broken. Um, okay, that, that's fine. That's fine. I'm also going to do an X potion while you're at it because that seems like the thing. I have got a limit break ready, but I don't know whether now is the time to use it. I think not. I, I don't know what you guys are thinking, but I'm thinking maybe we need it for the next fight. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, let's go. Let's go. How many are we at to now? Uh, five? Five. Okay, we've got a couple more to go. Uh, Toad, nice. What, what are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? Uh, I would like to ultimate you rather than um, going... Ooh, what's he going to do? What's he going to do? It's Northern Cross! He's very angry in a northern way. Brr, angry. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you, what's he going to do on the damage wise? Is it something to worry about? I didn't even touch me. Did not even touch me. Uh, I don't think a single ultimate is going to be enough. No, okay, but maybe a second one is. Freeze. I mean, like, honestly, I, I'm not all that bothered by your elemental attacks. I, I don't think I've got much to worry about here. Uh, I'm going to once again ultimate him. I've, I've got a feeling. Ooh. Yeah. There we go. I've got a feeling I'm not actually going to need uh, the Ultima until much later. Oh, I mean, do we do we now break that? No, 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 no. We're going to go for Mini. <laughs> I, w I was very tempted then for a second. Proud Clod, how are you doing? Here, have one of these. Uh, that that should help out pretty well here. All right, Omni Slash. It should, should not be tough. Now, I do know from reading from the internet that if I do a certain type of attack, I, I can't remember whether it's Berserk or something like that, uh, on Proud Clod. I don't actually get the points for the battle, uh, which is a little disappointing. A little disappointing. So is this enough to finish him off? That is the question. There was a, a lot of 3,000 hits. No, it wasn't. Okay. Uh, let me let me X potion again. Half half my half my health. It's uh, a little bit deadly. A little bit deadly. Knee fire. Uh, we're gonna once again slash all. Oh, yeah, of course. Why not? I can't remember how much we damage we have to do to this front armor here. Bap. That was pretty pretty powerful though. Pretty full. Uh, no no no. no. Uh, in fact, I shouldn't have done that out of panic. Material. I mean, that said, it should be a status effect. It's not actually gonna do anything against me because I've got a ribbon. Okay, 999 damages are pretty good. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Okay, here we go. A little bit of damage from the ultimate. Hopefully big points. I think the damage happened. I think the damage happened. Oh, look, he's like slightly transparent in there. I'm not sure if I like being able to see that. Um, P PG, can we get some censorship up there? I mean, like what? I can definitely see his weapon behind there. Uh, do I have to worry about health? It is something I should probably pay attention to. Yeah, especially as it's taking me this long to do my Ultima. Okay, we're going to drop another X potion. Man, I, I need more. I need more. I don't know whether we're going to get um, the final attack material just from the first fight or not. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, item, I think somewhere in here. Do we actually... Elixir? Let's do it. Got to find somewhere where we can get these from. Got to find it. That, that might be the thing that we do after this battle. Uh, knee fire. I'll give you knee fire. Um, okay, let's see. Let's see what happens from the hit. Hits more powerful than. Oh man, how many how many attacks did he get? Like two ago? It looks like two ago. Uh, yeah, but I need to get a more powerful attack than Ultima because this, bam, more powerful than any magic I can throw out. I suppose I could technically Knights of the Round him, but I, I, I don't know. It seems a little bit over the top. I, I kind of wish I would do a little bit of damage so that I could get my... Nope, no, no, get my limit bow up. That that would be great. That would be great. Okay, is this this one going to hit? Uh, I mean, it hit, but is it enough to do the damage? Uh, single nines, not the ones that I'm after. Oh, dear. Or am I about to do a bad? Mm -mm -mm. I mean, if I can kill him in one go here, that would be good. No, okay, that's not the one. Maybe again? Maybe again? Let's... I, I don't know how much damage we need to do here. 700 to go. Beam cannon. Let's wait and see if we need to do any healing. <laughs> you missed me. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, doing pretty well at dodging these attacks. Definitely need to get Cloud a few more dexterity sources, right? I mean, just because we're doing well enough to dodge all the attacks so far, doesn't mean we're going to miss them all forever. It is obviously the thing that I want to do. Oh man, could you imagine if literally no no hits would ever hit? I mean, it does look like no hits are ever going to hit here. He he seems pretty bad at his job. Pretty bad at his job. Am I just hitting? 
He gets a lot of attacks per single one of my attack. Uh, it would be nice if we could have like more from the slash all. Well, that was a little bit of damage. Counter attacks, yeah? Was that counter or? No, it must have been an attack because it wasn't like the slash all attack, like this one. You, know, you see how the, the, the stance is different? Uh, we're changing the. Was that it? Was that it? Woo! For winning the special battle, receive final attack material. That is what we are after. Woo! Yeah. What are you gonna do about it? Ooh, I'm better than you. <laughs> no, no, just, just no. Uh, what well, that? That is what we are after. You know how I was saying. I now need to go and have a look and see where we can get some uh, some uh, elixirs from. But yeah, I, I I would like to go and look for some. First, I'm gonna have a quick look through this page. Uh, yeah, literally everything we have already seen. Change my mind. Okay, thank you very much. Remember, these points become invalid when you leave. Bye. <laughs> so I have a list of places to go and check for places where we can find things to steal or more for whatever elixir is from. Hello, what's what's this side of this mountain over here? Oh, it's uh, it's the cat. Wow, suddenly loud noises. Let me just stop for that. Glorious day for it, can't really blame them. Hello! Do you guys see that over there? That is, of course, a ruby weapon. We've got to watch out for them. One of the guys that I'm supposed to be fighting is actually over here somewhere. Is there a dirt pile somewhere? Gold saucer area dirt is what I am looking for. You know, I might just try it around about roughly here. Let's let's get off of this and just walk back and forth. Did I put enemy lure on? You can see we've got Red 13 into the group, and of course Yuffie, because she is the person that that does all the um, all the morphing. Uh, <laughs> Red 13 almost entirely there just to try and get his level up. Uh, also, incidentally, we didn't we didn't max out mime. I was I was not sure about. I wasn't I wasn't aware of that. I wasn't aware of that at all. So we've got a couple of enemy laws on the go. That that should be fine. Ooh. All right, we'll try running on the edge here, see if this counts as dirt. It might just be sand. We are looking for a chimera. It's called a harpy, but it, it looks like a chimera, like, honestly. Uh, and that should be a nice and quick to finish off here. Yeah, okay, I'm just going to walk around until I encounter something. What I'm actually going to do, I'm going to start a timer right now. Once I've got myself two elixirs, we will count that as the, the time as the efficiency. So let's start my stopwatch rolling. I mean, technically, we've already started started but there we go start got the clock rolling i will see how long it takes for me to get two elixirs so i've been at this for about 10 minutes now and i've gone around and tried to establish the bounds of what actually classifies as the gold saucer area uh, i'm not entirely certain on this one but if we just cross this river here this was the last bounds to check just across that river there is definitely gold saucer area and i'm fairly sure we, yeah we've just walked into costa del sol area um i, I know this because of the bosses we're facing uh but not just that I, I will show you the other way of checking if yuffie doesn't quickly finish this guy off here bam any morph no no morph oh yeah there was a morph okay took, just took a second that's that's fine that's fine as you can see i have been getting a pathetic amount of ap and xp with every everything here but obviously i've also been getting uh, items and money uh so yeah we're in the corral area here that's a little bit unfortunate now the reason that i bring this up is because i went online and tried to find out where we could face these harpies that are actually chimeras um and it said that the formations were available in uh gold saucer area as you can see we are now in grasslands desert lands and uh, and dirtland and I was like, dirt land? Really? Is there dirt land around anywhere? I, I haven't seen any dirt land around anywhere. And I've been running around for quite some time. Anywhere that I feel like there could be dirt, like the edges of rivers or cliff faces or anything that, like that, I've got off and had a bit of a walk around and uh, made sure and got myself into a couple of encounters to see what the background is like because that is the thing that generally dictates all where you are the battle background uh, and this has given me no results the whole the whole way through you see now we're on a beach uh, this is this is kind kind of cool what what we're after oh does anyone have 
No, no one has. Unfortunately, this is one of the enemy skills that y um, Yuffie doesn't have. All right, let's do that. There, there was no real reason for doing the uh, big guard other than I really wanted to uh, to use an enemy skill there. Uh, I mean, it would be good if we could get a white wind out as well, thinking about it, but yeah, whatever. We have lost such little amounts of health there that it's not really a big problem. Let's see what happens when these guys all get struck and all turned into turbo ethers. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll take all those. Cheers, thanks. So, I mean, like, that's, that's nice. But still not the thing we're looking for. I, I think it's time for us to move locations. Yes, indeed. Where is uh, Gladys? Here she is. Hey, how are you doing? Let's just hop on. Uh, we're we're going to run. We're gonna, do I want to take the high wind with me? Do I want to take the high wind? It's really tempting to run across that. Uh, we're not going to do that, though. No, not yet. No, we. Uh, I don't know whether we want to face that one or Emerald first. I'm, not, I'm never sure which way we want to face them. So we're also going to jump in this bad boy. 13 minutes without a single elixir. We're going to call cool that one a terrible terrible way of doing this so let's restart that count and now i'm here at bone village uh which is uh, incidentally classed as the icicle area if we come out of here and have a look look icicle area icicle area grass we can run into a variety of things one of them being that weird dragon thing that's got like all the health we can morph that we can morph that so let's have a look and see what we get no not these guys not these guys so the first thing i'm gonna do is morph out here and see what we get uh start timer Let's see what the time is on this. Uh, Rib13, very, very weak on his um, limit use recently. As you can imagine with how much how much damage he's not been taken. Uh, at the same time, the covers are really coming in quite handy. He's been taking all the beatings there. Are we about to hit a million gil? Did you did you guys see that? Let's have a look down here. Uh, it, like The time is going to be nigh. The time is going to be nigh. A mere 100,000, well, 150,000 to go. Okay, is this the boy we're after here? No, no, it's not. But again, really easy to finish off here. And uh, did, did they actually morph into anything we wanted to see? Let's have a look. Bam. No, it's just a death. Okay, well, there we go. Uh, I'm going to keep walking until we run into one of those things. And then I'll let you know. What is it? The Val... Or something like that. Uh, I'm sure if I didn't try and roll that R, it would have made more sense. Okay, this is the boy we are after. Now, if I remember correctly, nobody has a gravity-based thing. Does, does this have one? I'm fairly sure something here uh, by one half. Let's try that. Let's see if we can do that. And, um, maybe we'll do the white wind now, and then we'll do a morph. Let, let, let's see if that... Okay, so that's 8,000. We probably need to do that, like, I don't know, 10 more times, something like that. But it should be nice and easy as long as we keep these guys up. I suppose another good one would have been the big guard. Let, let's get that, because this guy oof, does a violent advance, man. That's a power. That's a power. And then we wanted laser. Does any others do anything that's kind of like half? Bad breath, aqua fire, lightning. Uh, just, just loads of stuff, non-elemental. Uh, does damage equal to the user's HP? Ooh, I mean, that's powerful. That's powerful. Non-elemental, non death, or rule Okay, yeah, no, it looks like laser is the only one we're after there. Okay, we can definitely make use of that. And these guys are just going to punt out the lasers. That, that's all that's going to happen until he's ready. Oh, look, 5,000. This might be the one. Slam. No, oh, all right, all right, fine. Be like, be like that. Uh, we're going to carry on doing that anyway, and then we morph again and see what that is like. Okay, so that's a 2,000. Violent advance. <laughs> so violent, so violent. So that this has taken about three minutes so far. I, I'm all over this being a thing. Uh, we could have... Yeah, let's get Red 13 to mime again. That's, that's good. Honestly, that's... You're not winning yet? We're not winning yet? Is I mean, It says one half. It did actually say one half, right? I'm not just making that up. I'm, I'm barely sure it said it would take off half health. Uh, 166. Come on, that's got to be enough now. There we go. Beautiful. Elixir. All right, cool. Let's see how long it takes us to get the second one, shall we? <laughs> that, that's the important bit here. Helmet, like, with a 10-minute... 10 minute test we can times that by six and know roughly how many we get an hour right that's that's kind of how this is gonna work okay this is looking pretty good this second one was in a very short period of time oh, i still haven't got the up yet okay let's start with a laser there and then we'll go for an enemy skill we'll go for another laser let's see how many lasers we can pump out 
in the first round. Well, I should imagine three. Probably a big guard would have done better, as like that would have given haste to everyone, hoist to everyone. Uh, so we'll have to, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll give, give that a go. Uh, enemy skill. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, let, let's try the morph. Let's try the morph and see how we do doing with that. Then we're going to get red on the big guard and get another laser out. Okay, that, 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 that feels pretty good. Pretty good. And Yuffie hits with the morph again. That, that, that should work, right? That should work. Uh, red 13 on the mine, if we could. It's now all about just trying to get it down. What is that, 2,000 points? This should be the point now where we're just doing a nice, easy, easy morph. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to push on. It's looking that we're going to get about four in 10-minute segment there, depending on our luck with the enemy skill, of course. Uh, enemy lure, of course. Okay, and that's the 10 minute test done. Seems like we're getting three every 10 minutes. That's that's all right. I mean, that's that's not amazing, but 12 an hour, 12 an hour. Okay, let's take the high wind. And almost everything else, if I just quickly double check my list, yeah, is to be found in the Northern Cave. Now, hopefully this should be all good. Wait, 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 I've kind of lost my way. There we go. Uh, hopefully this should be all good. We know how we are moving around down here, so let's go and do it. It's going to take a little while to get down here, but th thankfully the first screen is the first place I want to be. And in, th in fact, just walk it. No, not that way, this way, get around that rock. We can do it, we can do it. All right, let's go. Okay, I am looking for the dark dragons. These are li literally the dragons that inhabit this place. Unfortunately, so, it's not quite as good as the guys that we can morph because there's only something like a 12% chance that they're actually gonna have it. Uh, the same can be said of, uh, so Master Tombrys, we can steal from the Master Tombry, and there also is a, a horse type thing that turns up with a little jester guy, um, in one of the other screens down here, the watery place. Okay, this guy, okay, we can deal with these pretty quickly, in fact, we should be able to set these up. Red Dean looking pretty weak on all his attacks, I mean, he's got the health, that has to be said, he's look, pr looking pretty tanky. But, yeah, he's not doing so well on the attacks. We just literally had one of his limits. He did 2,000 points of damage. I mean, like, what? Again, 600. What is this? What is this? Level 4 death. Uh, we know that Red 13 is going to die. Uh, I, I know this. Yep. That's it's annoying, to say the least. That is annoying. Hopefully, someone will get a go before they actually kill this guy. That, mm, freeze. Wow. Mm, this isn't going to be great, if I'm to be honest. It's not going to work out well. I would have liked to have used an enemy skill on Red 13 there. Uh, oh, it can't... No, no, no. Level 4. That That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. I wonder how much damage I need to do to stop them attacking. Anyway, I, I need to stop talking, so I'm going to completely fill up this episode with rubbish. Okay, so the Dark Dragon, we just need to be up as quick as possible. If we could just take him down, that would be good. We're not looking to more for whatever. Uh, so, oh, I should have started a little while ago when we fought, fought those first guys. But it's been less than a minute, I, I reckon. Less than a minute. Okay, so that, that was pretty good. Do we get the Elixir this turn? Let's have a look. Uh, well, Elemental leveled up. Thumbs up with that. No elixir, though. No elixir. That's unfortunate. So, magic counter. There we go. Elemental. I only paired it with the lightning so it could do something. Oh, look. We're about to get bolt two, though. Uh, shall we swap this one out with the other one? That, that, I mean, it did turn over pretty quickly. Oh, that might, might have been because it was very close to turning over anyway. Let's go and have a look and see what else we can do here. I mean, Quadramagic needs to be pretty strong, though. It would have been better paired with something other than lightning. Added a, uh, added cut. Uh, I mean, mm, well, well, yeah, mm, yeah, go on then, go on then. Uh, I was opening and ahhing a lot, but I, I think we'll go with it. I think we'll go with it. Okay, so with next, next dragon, next dragon. Okay, so about 10 minutes spent down here fighting, and I've got to say, I made zero, zero elixirs, so that's not a good one. We now need to try and make our way down towards, oh wait, great, awesome. Caught by surprise again. We need to now need to try and make our way down towards the flooded zone down below. And I, oh, I can't remember whether I need to go left or right, so that's going to take a little bit of time to figure out. Do I go down the spiral, then make a choice? I think, yeah, I think it's down the spiral, then make a choice, right? That that should be right. I just got to try and take care of these guys. I've learned that um, morphing them doesn't trigger their, like, death counter attack. Ooh, is, is he going to? Is he not? Oh, I wonder why one of them did, but the other didn't. Oh, well, rip, ripping up the... Uh, 
Yeah, Red 13. It's, um... He dies a lot down here, it's got to be said. <laughs> He's just got that, that wrong level number. Just got that wrong level number. Okay, I think this is the room that I'm supposed to be in. The only thing I've got is water path and water crossing. This seems like the place that could be described with water path and water crossing. Oh, magic pots now. I am after these, but I don't, I mean, do I have any? Do I have any? Let's have a look. I mean, we, if we go down and go Elixir and go to one of these and then, oh, I didn't have W item, did I? <laughs> well, let's try it anyway. Uh, you and, I mean, another one would have been good. I, I've got, I've got another. Let's, let's do it. Whilst we're here, this is why we're doing this. Now, if I remember, is it, do we now just attack them? Is, is that what's going on? We now we now we just full on, I mean, can we morph them? Is that a thing? Can we morph them? I don't know. I, oh, no, no, we can't morph them. But I think the whole reason that we're on this uh, this elixir journey should be clear now. Look at that 2,000 AP up there. <sighs> Beautiful. Shield, sneak attack, mine, enemy lore. Oh, man, it was just, oh. Oh, it's why we're here, guys. This is literally why we're here. I've, I've now got to, like, get off here, get onto a path and press this. Uh, Materia is just suddenly all up in the air. I, I mean, I don't even know. I don't even know. Are any of these maxed out? No, okay, that's cool. All of these up here should be maxed out because it's a, a mastered weapon, um, a non-growth. So shield is maxed out. Ah, uh, guys. Do you know what that means? Oh, guys, momentous occasion. I was not expecting it. We have just part. I, I can't. Can, can I get some? Like, over here? I, can, I know I can press the menu over here. Wow, it turns out menu pressing is hard here. So I was facing... Oh, Master Tombre, we need to... Um, uh, enemy skill. We need to do a big guard. And then in here, Bolt 2 should be steel as well, if I remember correctly. We need to try and steal off of this guy. And look, we don't have any way of doing that. Uh... So, elixir, like to, uh, I don't know, cloud, and then you cancel? No, that's not right. That's how you that's how you lose them. Oh, I'm supposed to do another one. I don't know. Let's, let's try this. Let's uh, steal as much as we can off of him, if possible. Red 13, ready for a limit. Blood fang, whatever, buddy. Did did she steal? That was the question there. Did she steal as well? Because we would have got another elixir. Uh, I did not see. But see what I'm saying about him? 2,000 points of damage there. It's not the win. Oh, everyone's grudge. No. Uh, this is probably going to be a dead cloud. Yeah, okay. Enemy skill, angel whisper. Oh, oh, final attack materia comes into play. Have it. It's what I'm here for. <laughs> oh, that, that, that's great. That's great. That is amazing. This is, this is why you put it on there. Because not only is it about to do a whole heap ton of damage to my friend there, uh, but we also then get to go, oh, he's still alive. Great. Does he... Has he got full health as well? That's even better. Uh, laser. Did that steal? I didn't see... Ah, oh, it's Slash as well. That is unfortunate. Everyone's grudge once again. <laughs> we can try it, but I mean, honestly, no one's that bothered. No one is that bothered. Enemy skill, Angel Whisper. Let's put that down on oh, Yuffie over there. Yuffie does have Gauntlet to use. Uh, so, no stealing at the moment. We'll have to try and figure something out about that. So Someone must have Mug. Uh, we'll be able to give it to Yuffie at least. Bam, no. Oh, still not dead. Still not dead. Uh, enemy skill, oh, that's that's fine. Uh, let's mime, no, that's that's a bad idea. Let's first get Yuffie to morph and then we'll mime. Uh, and that should be better. Oh, that was a good strong hit. That was a good strong hit. Let's do a uh, big guard again. Looks like everybody could do, oh no, no, everybody couldn't use it. I thought everybody could, I was wrong. Uh, Yuffie's gonna morph again, that is a definite. Oh, he's getting close, he's getting close. Uh, for those of you that are not aware, when he gets up and uses his knife, it's insta-death for whoever gets, uh, whoever gets it, whoever gets stabbed. But there we go, we got ourselves another ribbon. I'm, I'm sure we can, we can sell that? I don't know, can we? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. Oh, something else leveled up as well, but crossed a million gill as well. Did you see? Like, this definitely the place to be, but not right now. Oh, can I not back? There is no back. Oh, 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 okay, well, forwards, oh, forwards only, let's go. The elixir hunt might have got a little bit messy at the end there, but I think it is time for us to draw a conclusion out of this episode. So by far the quickest legit method for taking, for getting elixirs is by far morphing this guy. It might take some time, but wow, it is worth it. 
that is a mess. Of course, you've got this W item. At which point, you come down to an elixir. You click, you go, I want to give it to you. And then you go for another elixir. You go, no, wait. Oh, three of them. Let me just click. Oh, four of them. Let me just click again. Oh, five. No, I don't want that. You click and cancel. Click and cancel. Click and cancel. And you just build up this ever-increasing stack of elixirs. Now, I don't know about you, but I, I happen to think this is pretty cheesy. Uh, you, you wouldn't really catch me as a legit gamer exploiting this at any point, especially when you can get three every ten minutes out of fighting these guys. That's, that's 12 an hour, guys. I mean, it would take you a mere five hours to get to the point where we are now. So wh why would you even want to do this when you could just grind out a bunch of elixirs? I don't know. I mean, I leave that ethical decision down to you guys. It, obviously not something that I'm going to do at any point. But uh, let, let me know how you feel. Let me know how you feel about that. Okay, I'm going to go enemy skill and uh, laser here. Uh, and we're going to quickly mop up this bad boy. One thing I did want to show you is the fact that both Yuffie and Red 13 have got their second part. I, I don't know how to get rid of that bit of target marker. I've got the second part of their le uh, limit level. So we'll have a quick look at that before we finish. This episode has been like two hours in the making. Just, just wanted to push that out there, guys. You know, if you, if you want to, if you want to comment a GG down below, let me know. Let me know. <laughs> that would be pretty good. All right, I was really expecting the damage to have been done here. Let's see what the lasers are pumping out. It's like it says half, right? Lessons HP's uh, lessons opponents. HP by half, so like by all means, we should have been should have been getting the more from the last one. Like I really do. I mean, which button is this? That that button, that button right there. Okay, well cool. We, we've got rid of that. I'm sure I'm gonna forget by the next time. <laughs> That, is that the morph? Okay, there's the morph. And we get our precious elixir. This is what we are after. Of course, we need the elixirs for feeding to the magic pots down below to get, give us, like, the big, big, um... Uh, big big APs. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, let's just have a quick look in here and come to our limit levels. Yuffie has got Doom of the Living. If we go and have a look down here, continuously attacks all opponents. It's like Omni Slash, but about half as powerful. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. And we come across a two red thirteen who has got attacks all opponents. Stardust Rain. I've not done it yet. I've not done it. We will see that next time, where indeed we will be going all the way over to Cosmo Canyon to uh, to do a little thing over there. But I will see you then when we're gonna do that. Bye! Shouldn't have walked.